Hey guys, it's Chad Chung here. I am so excited because today you're going to see how the Hilo and the app works together, how the measurement works, the features and the function, and if there's anything you need to set up, we're going to show it all in the video today. So um, I think we, I want to do it in the, our theater room. Welcome to our home. Uh, I think I'm doing a theater room because it's quiet, uh, but I think it's a little bit dark. Is it a little bit dark, Matita? Yeah, okay. You know what? Let's, let's do it outside. Come on. Follow us. Um, I think let's do it on the snooker table. At least it's nice and bright and everybody can see how this app works. So once you get in, let me just do the password. Open the Hilo app. And uh, I want to put the Hilo and the phone next to each other. So anyway, you're in the app. Here's all the measurements. One thing I want you to know is that one of the first things you need to do is make sure that uh, you calibrate uh, your, um, your helo to your blood pressure. So how do you do that? You will just run your uh, blood pressure. And guys, in this video, what we'll do is instead of everyone waiting for the countdown, we'll fast forward the countdown. So it's going to fast forward right now. So what you see is, you see my results, you see repeat and done, but for the first time you run it in the middle, there's an orange button that says calibrate. And what you need to do is to press calibrate and adjust your systolic and this, this diastolic measurements based on what uh, you generally get. So how do you get that? You can have a blood pressure machine at your house. If you don't, you can go to a local pharmacy, maybe CVS. Uh, and run it and, and see what that number is and adjust it. Not everybody needs to do it because what this Hilo has done is realize that you know 70, 80 percent of people are around 120 over 80. If you are not part of that range, uh, it's always good to double check and calibrate. Uh, the other thing I want to share with you why guys. Don't, why don't you show them how you could also calibrate in case that button doesn't pop up? So, as uh, Natita suggested. You can go into the settings and go back to uh, your settings here and you can go reset calibration, right? One thing I want to share with all of you is that your Hilo is not a tool for you to share. Because of our advanced chipset that we have here, it gets to know your body. So don't share it, keep it on, and the more the Hilo is ran, the more it gets to know you and the more accurate uh, your results will be. Now, how do you run, uh, how do you choose how often you want to run it? R really simple. Go to health plan. In here at the moment is run every two hours. Uh, the longest is two hours. You can make it actually go shorter. If you click on that, you can choose every 30 minutes, if you like, every 45 minutes or so on. I'm just going to leave it every two hours right now. And let's go run the report. If you're on the front dashboard, look, look, that's the steps I did since the last check. Uh, I've been sitting around a lot, but uh, you can see my mood is exciting. So over here are quick measurements. Uh, the first one uh, is your heart rate. The second one is your blood pressure. And the third one does your full health check. So what we're going to do is do the full health check. Uh, we're going to fast forward in a moment. But as you can see, I'm putting my finger on the symbol that has a heart. I want you all to understand that this finger is just to show the diagram. Uh, in reality, every time it runs the full health check, you don't need to put your finger. The finger is just for the diagram uh, for on a graph. Um, it will still let you know if the results uh, once they finish with the heart check. So we're going to fast forward the video right now. All right. As you can see, my uh, beats per minute is 83. My blood pressure is 130 over 78, and my ECG is normal. Now, I'm just going to do one last test, which is really cool. Uh, this is the latest results. One last test I'm going to share with you is let's go to the menu. Let's go to our mood and fatigue. That's really cool. So as you can see, my mood is calm, as you can hear in my voice, but my fatigue level is tired, which is true because we are so excited building this business rare enough. So guys, I'm excited for you. Go through all the features. 
My name is Chad and I'm a world changer.